Are you looking to replace your Shopify contact form with JotForm? Well, that is possible, and I'm going to show you how on this video. So let's go jump over to my desktop right now. Welcome to JotForm. My name is George, and today I'm going to show you how to replace your Shopify contact form with JotForm. That way you can take full advantage of the advanced settings that we have on JotForm. So let's go ahead and create a basic form for this demo. So let's go ahead and create a form and we'll select start from scratch and classic form. We're gonna build a basic form. So let's go ahead and add some elements here and let's go ahead and add the email. Okay, let's keep it basic. That's, this is what we're going to use. Let's go into publish platforms and we are going to search for Shopify. Here it is. Let's go ahead and select it. And this is the code that we are going to need. So let's go ahead and over to our Shopify store. So this is my Shopify dashboard and we're going to go into online store. This is the theme that we have right now. And what we want to do is, well, change the contact form that it has to use job form. So for that case, we are going to go into pages and we are going to replace this. So let's go ahead and delete this one and we are going to add a new page. So let's go ahead and add one. And we're going to say contact form just for demo purposes. And we're going to click on the show HTML. So let's click on that. And now we are going to add the code that we grabbed from job form. So this will be the contact theme. So that's what we're going to use. Let's go ahead and save this. Okay, so we have that page available. And let's go ahead and view this page. So let's go ahead and open this up. And here it is. Here's the contact form that we've just created. So let's go into our theme, customize. And if we go to contact, we're gonna add that page. So let's go ahead and go into pages, contact. And here it is. Here's the form that we've just created. So now it's embedded to our site. That way we can use JotForm on Shopify. So that way we can take full advantage of all the settings that we have on JotForm that makes it really, really popular to use. But there you go. That is how you're going to use your JotForm on Shopify. We thank you all for watching and we'll see you on our next tutorials.